My name is Shankar. I'm basically an architect by qualification, but I style myself as a social activist. Uh, I belong to an organization called uh, Habitat Technology Group, which I founded in 1987. Habitat has become probably one of the largest NGO initiatives in this part of the world. We have a huge presence uh, not only in India but also in Bangladesh, Sri Lanka and a few countries like that. We also have some presence in Africa, Morocco, Sudan, uh, Nigeria, etc. We are working in the field of sustainable architecture. All our life we have been talking about cost efficiency, we have been talking about energy efficiency and we have been talking about eco-friendliness in building construction and technologies. Um, I actually got involved with Global Energy Parliament in connection with my interest for alternate energy. Uh, I've been involved with the Ashram Swamiji for the, probably for the last two decades. And uh, I'm highly impressed with the kind of passion and devotion with which he's, uh, you know, promoting some of his ideas. Uh, his idea about energy resource is something that's amazing and uh, which I think can change your perceptions right away. You can blow up, you can blow away all your concepts about, you know, uh, the present concepts about energy, the way energy, I mean, he's first time probably in the world, he's talking about the spiritual dimension to energy. Uh, we, are, we have been dealing with physical dimensions all the time. And here's a person who's combining physical dimensions of energy with uh, the spiritual dimensions of energy, which I think uh, will be a critical link in uh, addressing some of the energy concerns that we have. As an activist, social activist is involved with building construction, I thought there are several areas where uh, I could uh, bank on, harp on, and uh, work with Swamiji on this particular theorem. Now, uh, I had also been involved with Global Energy Parliament right from the beginning, and uh, we have been huge success in it. So I'm actually looking forward uh, to this energy parliament which is going to happen in London. Uh, I'm quite familiar with that landscape and the mindscape because I had my master's and you know, doctoral studies in England and uh, I'm sure uh, with the kind of passion and the dedication that the organizers are pursuing this dream is going to be a huge success.